Hello, I'm Mr. Namba and welcome to my Mars and Science Room. And today we are going to discuss questions on decimals. Example, express 0 0.4414414 as the ratio of two integers. Solution of this kind of question, first of all, you have to look at this number. Which numbers are repeating? Having 0 0.441, then again 441, therefore means 4, 4, and 1 are the numbers or digits which are repeating. Therefore, you let all of this number as x or any variable you like. Therefore, x equals to 0 0.4414414, whereby this number you can also write it as 0 0.441, these two, two, uh, two digits, two repeating signs may be put here and here, or you may put here, here, and here, so as to show 4, 4, and 1 all are repeating. Therefore, after this, you multiply by a thousand because we have three digits which are repeating. We have three digi digits which are repeating, which are four, four, and one. Therefore, after that, you'll have a thousand times x to the left-hand side, and you'll have 0 0.441, all of them are repeating, times a thousand. Therefore, after you multiply, you'll have a thousand x equals to four, four, one, but you after the decimal point, you again write that number which is repeating as four, four, one. Therefore, after that, you subtract x from each side. You subtract x from each side, whereby you'll have 1,000x minus x equals to 441 decimal 441. All of these numbers are repeating. You subtract what is x. x was 0 0.441, all of them repeating. Therefore, after you do subtraction, this and this will cancel. They will have 441 remaining. Therefore, that will have 999x or... 999x equals to 441. Therefore, if you want to find the value of x, therefore, you divide by 999 both sides, then you'll have 441 divided by 999. Therefore, after having that, you can simplify. If at all, it can be, it can be simplified by, um, by 9. By 9 here, you'll have 436. Therefore, again, you'll have after 36, you will remain with 8. 9 to 81 is 9. Therefore, 9 to 9 is 1. 9 to 9 is 1. 9 to 9 is 1. Therefore, you will have 0 0.4414414 as 49 over 111. Example 2. Convert the repeating decimal 0 0.5. 2 is repeating and 5 is repeating to fractions. Solution. The trick is that we should make the digits which are repeating after the decimal point. So, from 0 0.5 to 5, 2 and 5 are repeating, let y equals to 0 0.5, 2 is repeating and 5 is repeating. Multiply by 10 so as the digit which is repeating to appear after the decimal point. Therefore, if we multiply 10 by y, 10 times y, you get 10y, and if you multiply 0 0.5, 2, 5, 2, and 5 are repeating times 10, you'll have, you'll have 5.25, whereby 2 and 5 are repeating. Therefore, after that, since we have two digits which are repeating, then we multiply by 100 both sides. You multiply 100 by times 10y, which equals to 5.25, 2 and 5 are repeating times 100, then you'll have 1,000y equals to 5 to 5.25, 2 and 5 are repeating. Therefore, after that, you subtract y, no, no, you, you, you subtract 10y, you subtract 10y from both sides. After you subtract 10y from both sides, you'll have 1,000y minus 10y, which equals to 990y, and in, into the right-hand side, you'll have 5 to 5 to 5.25, 2 and 5 are repeating, minus 5.25, 2, 5 are repeating, you get 5, 2, 0. Therefore, you'll have 990y equals to 5, 2, 0. Therefore, you divide by 990, 990, so as you can remain with y. Therefore, you'll have y equals to 5, 5, 2, 0, divided by 990. Therefore, 0 and 0 will go, we remain with 5, 2, Divide by 99 or 52, you divide by 99. Thank you.